Hi guys, it's Deligracy here and I'm really excited to be playing Unravel today with you guys. I thought um, we'd start off a new game. I just played a little bit to like settle my camera up and my recording up and uh, also because I wanted to check it out a little bit before I started showing you guys. Uh, I am usually just a simmer, but my aim this year now that I'm doing YouTube full time is to start exploring other games and so Unravel's a game I've been really looking forward to just because it is so beautiful. As you can see right now, it has this beautiful starting screen uh, that shows this old lady looking at a photograph. Her eyes look almost a bit teary and it seems like she's remembering something. The soundtrack for this game, I believe, has been given a lot of attention. It's a lovely soundtrack to play to. And I just think it's a very peaceful game to play and very addictive. So anyways, the game uh, revolves around this little guy, Yanni. And he uh, comes from a yarn ball, which we're about to see right now, unravel. <laughs> and uh, there's a little bit of gibberish on the cushion there, I think. I don't think that means anything. Uh, but yeah, he's so cute. Maybe I'll just put him on my back here. And uh, I guess he's not a he or a she, but I'm just going to call him he because... I don't know. To me, that seems right. <laughs> uh, but yeah, let's get started. So uh, we're in this little, I guess, um, house area. We've got some really cute graphics here, little teacup photos, gorgeous little flickering candle. And you can kind of get an idea from here that this game has a really lovely depth of field, how it's blurred in the background and, uh, you know, lots of nice colors, but again, soft lighting and it just just really sweet. Uh, this is the first level and I believe I could be wrong but as you get further through the game you grab memories which you then if we just run back here a little bit you can pop those memories in a photo album that's just sitting on the table up here. So this album just here uh, has nothing in it right now. All the photos are kind of ruined or they're just not really happening. So uh, that's kind of what we have to unlock and the creators of the game said the game is about the journey of love and they say that as Yanni this little character unravels it symbolizes him moving further away from what he loves it's very interesting it's very very interesting and there's a lot of uh kind of memories that seem to be unlocked and it just, the whole game, the mood of it's very nostalgic, at least from what I've experienced so far. So let's get started. He's wandering out of the big house, going into the big world. Oh my God, Yanni. I have so much fun. Um, but you, yeah, you guys have to put up with me. I'm not really great at playing computer games. I, oh my gosh, that was really cute with the butterfly, how he reacts to it um, and kind of looks up and looks around him beautiful music too. I love how the flowers just kind of bubble around to the music. It's just such a beautiful game. Very magical. So as you can see here, he can't go any further. So what are we going to do? We're going to find the yarn up there and we're going to grab it and pull this down. And then he can grab more yarn uh, to get further in the game. And this is kind of what I've, what I've experienced in the game so far. It's just about trying to get through the game whilst unraveling. And uh, yeah, you can push and pull objects. We're gonna pull this uh, back to get over it. Whoops, we can climb back up our yarn. Um, but it is a game of, I guess you could say logic. I might push this one just a little bit forward. Um, and well, it's a puzzle game, I guess. And it only moves sideways as well. So you can't explore the background or anything, which I think is good because then it allows the game to be really, um, I don't know, really mysterious in a way or imaginative or something. But yeah, you can like swing from things like this. You go, wee. that and when you get to this 
like sparkly stuff in the air. This is like a memory, which, well, at least I believe it symbolizes a memory. It kind of puts that in his pocket and he continues on. And that's actually what ends up going in the photo album, I think, later in the game. If you see these bubbly sparkles, you can climb up the surfaces. You can then jump and throw a lasso. Whoa! And if you fall down, it's a little bit awkward, but you can usually get back up again. Swing. That, grab some more yarn. He just does that automatically. But yeah, as I said, this game is like seriously addictive and very relaxing to play. So it's kind of, I don't know. It's just, I haven't really experienced gameplay like this before in terms, well, mostly because I just play The Sims, but I haven't really experienced gameplay before that's so relaxing. I used to play a little bit of Nintendo back in the day. Uh, and it was always very like switched on, very active. And this is just kind of like, you're just figuring out the puzzles as you go. And I like that. Oh no, we dropped an apple, have we? Can I bounce on this as well? Get those apples to fall, which is kind of fun. Climb up here. I love the apples in the trees, they're so pretty. Up we go, damn. We'll jump for the money, Yanni. Oh yeah. Hmm, let's tie some knots up here. I think that's what we're meant to do on the other one, my bad. There we go, tie another knot over here and we're gonna create a little springboard, I think. Yeah, there we go. So we can go wee, wee. And grab some more yarn for us. How do we do this? Pull the left stick down and press A to jump down from certain platforms. Oh, okay, I got it. Oops, and then we can climb down safely like that. Okay, cool, awesome. Oh man, I feel like eating apples. I bet these are like pink ladies. Mmm, yummy. Oh, okay, let's run along here. See the whirling light? This means you'll start here and come back to this level. Excellent. So we know that our game's, I guess, saved at that point. Whenever you see sparkles, it basically means you're meant to do something, so. I've got some apples here. Let's maybe push the apple up. Yay! Oh, I love those flowers. I'm pretty sure those are edible flowers. I've had them, I put them on my Instagram the other day. And uh, they were on crumpets and pancakes. Yes, I had crumpets and pancakes in the same week. But I had a real swoop, uh, swoop teeth. I had a real sweet tooth last week. And I don't know what it was, but all I felt like was sugar the whole week. And that was bad. It's, it's not something I'm proud of. All right, so we've got all these apples. I feel like I shouldn't have put those apples there. I don't know. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. We're all good. We're all G. So that's gonna fill up. I don't know if Yanni drowns. I don't know if he even dies in this game. I guess he might. Uh, but this is kind of cool. I guess, can we get another apple? The water graphics are very beautiful. Nah, there's no more apples. We can only have three. Oh, wait. Is this... Wanna... Okay, we can grab these apples. Oh, damn it. There we go. Can I push this? I'm gonna pull it. I'll pull this apple. And then push it over. There we go. The apples look so real. I feel like that's a real apple right there on my screen. I like that. Okay, let's just walk across these bobbing apples. Oh, no. <gasps> Yanni! There we go. We made it. If you ever get stuck, hold that key to go back to a section. Oh, magpie. Love magpies. Oh, it's so beautiful. Like, I wish I lived in this house. It's so nice. 
It looks like we're kind of exploring a beautiful family home. What's this? What do I do? Pull it back? No? Climb up it? I don't know what to do with this. I need to move it. Can I hold on to it? No. Can we just keep pulling it back? I don't know. I wonder if this game was complicated to make in terms of no, I just keep running along. Okay. Yay! Oh, it looks like we're moving into the shadows. Uh-oh. Yeah, I thought it was too good to be true. <laughs> oh, I see. We totally missed this spot. There we go. Gotta get in here. Yay! More unraveling. Okay, what's down here then? Keep on getting across here. Climb back up our unravel. I just love the whole concept of this game. The fact that he's a little yarn ball. I just love that. Whee! Alright, what's down here? Oh, bicycle! Gotta love a good bike. Uh... How do we ride the bike? Do we pull it? Oh. Okay, I feel like we're meant to tie ourselves up there. Can we? Hmm. Can we get up into it? Yeah, we can. We can walk through it. Up we go! Yes. We just jump down onto the front wheel? No, can't do that. Um, let's walk through, try and get up again. And just pull it? I guess, just pull it along. Go Yanni, go, you can do it. Muscles. I wonder if we ram it into the... Oh no, that didn't work. I thought if we rammed it into the fence, it would like knock it down. Up we go. Oh! Woo! Oh my god. I'm scared. Yanni, you badass, you ball of yarn. Oh, that looks like it really hurt. Okay, whoops. Knocked that off. And jump for the money! Yes. Jump! Damn it! <laughs> really stuffed that one up. Okay, jump, get that, and now we're gonna do a bit of swinging. And jump! Yes! Oh, it's so beautiful. I really like this uh, kind of tree. I'd like to have that in my garden one day, actually. Okay, Yanni. Yes! Yes! And jump! Woo! Reckon we can climb onto the top of this one? I reckon we can. Oh, actually, I changed my mind. I don't think so. <laughs> Let's just swing around and jump across. Excellent. Got another memory falling here. Oh, a child in a tree house. Oh, grabs that memory. Uh, oops. Gonna reveal another little ball of yarn and another save point for the game. But let's keep on going. We ain't finished yet. Uh, I'm scared that there's gonna be something bad down here. Oh no. Oh, there's so much nostalgia in this game. Like the the memories of children. There's almost a bit of a sadness, but you don't really know why you're sad. It's just weird. Like. Oh, we got a seesaw, okay. <gasps> oh! Hello, Echidna, hello! Aw, I love these little details in the game. 
Why can't I? What? What is this? What? Do you reckon we're meant to? Oh yeah, tie the yarn. Going across the seesaw. Beautiful old seesaw. It's so sad that they don't have seesaws in parks anymore. Oh, okay, I see what we gotta do. Gotta go back and get that. Get that little letter block. Here we go. Oh, where is the letter block? Oh, it's way back here. I thought that letter A one was our our one. Uh, okay, so we need to go up here, tie that. Where is that letter block? Hmm. Oh, there it is. Oops, getting my... My controls confused. And by the way, uh, I probably should have mentioned I am playing this on PC and I'm using a Xbox controller on my PC to play it, which I'm finding to be nice and easy to use. Okay, I think we're going to have to maybe leave that just there so we can run and jump off this. There we go. Oh, look at the bird. So sweet. Who are we swinging to, do you guys reckon? Are we climbing straight up or are we swinging? Hmm. Whee! Oh, I like this little swing. Oh, this is kind of, this feels weird, the swinging now. It's hard to get momentum. I'm pretty sure the swinging part is the most difficult or challenging thing for me. Can we just jump up on there? Awesome. Oh. Ooh, this just got really creepy. We're up to another save point and I'm scared right now. I'm not scared, but it feels like we've hit night time. So I guess there is, there is an element of time in this game, which I like. Um, so we can't get up there. Let's see. What's this? Oh, okay, we've got something to pull here. Why does that sparkle? Why is this red? What does that mean? Does that mean we can jump higher, maybe? I can't, excuse me. Can I jump? Oh, thank you. Oh, no, that's not right. No, that doesn't feel right at all. I think we want to tie our yarn there. Can we then tie... I'm confused, how do we get the red sparkles on both? Mm, okay, I don't exactly know how that worked. But I'm wondering if we need to... Whee! Oh, I see something up there. I feel like we need to grab whatever that is. But I also feel like we need to use this cube just because it's there. Lift it to where it goes. Go. that was easy <laughs> thought that was gonna be a lot more difficult okay so we've just grabbed something I don't know if you get that per level what are these for I think this means you jump higher not entirely sure but we can <gasps> oh! oh no oh Yanni oh that was impressive Wow, oh, this is pretty. So we're back in the daylight. Maybe we were just in in a dark shed then. I thought it was nighttime. I love how he looks around and takes it in. This is so pretty, all the autumnal colors. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, that is so cute. And I'm guessing that's the end of this level. Aww. Oh my 
my god, I want to cry in this game. It's so beautiful. I don't even know why it's beautiful. It just is. It's so poetic. Ooh, okay, so I feel like we've put our memories back in our photo book. Let's have a look. Thistle and Weeds, how beautiful this was when it was new and how beautiful it still is, even though time has made it different. How beautiful this was when it was new and how beautiful it's... Oh, so it's kids playing near a barn or near the house. I guess this is the house we just explored. Climbing the trees. The cubby house, the sand pit. Okay, so we've explored and found all of these memories and put them in the book. It's very interesting. Oh, there's the tire swing and the beautiful sunflower. Sunflowers happen to be one of my favorites. Swinging. We swung on that swing, you guys. All the flowers, butterflies. It's very, very pretty. And inside the shed, maybe? That's the shed we were in. And it looks like there's nothing else left. Okay. All right. So if we go back... Uh, oh, and we've got one piece of the photograph there. I'm assuming it will all... What's that on the floor? Is that a mouse trap? Oh, no, it's a little trap door. That's cool. Love the fire burning. I guess as we collect the memories, that photo will become completed. But this is the one we just did. It said one of five secrets found. So I don't know if we missed some stuff in there or if that's the first of five. And then we've got the sea, Berry Meyer. So they're the next two levels. Anyways, I'm going to leave this right here. Um, I really enjoy it. I'm really enjoying this game. I am kind of addicted. I want to keep playing. So if you guys want me to post my gameplay, let me know. Uh, if you want this Let's Play to continue. And I just love it. Um, anyways, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon, or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon. Bye.